Did you ever consider that Mr. Finn at the bookstore that day was offering you clues to the treasure's location? If so, consider for a moment one word clue he repeated both during his interview as well as in the text of The Thrill of the Chase. Listen again for that one particular word he offered. That one word clue was maverick. Let's go back and listen to Mr. Finn at the Moby Dickens bookshop. Watching you all the time. Which would you rather have? The desert. That's my philosophy. <laughs> but anyway, I'll, I'll admit I'm a maverick in that, in that area. Mr. Finn also offered other helpful information during the same interview. Yes. Uh, my family is taken care of, but but uh, but I'm another maverick in that area. The last thing I want to do is is make my kids or grandkids wealthy. So if you if you're really serious about looking for the treasure, get the thrill of the chase and, and read it, and then go back and read the poem over and over and over again, and then go back and read the book again, but slowly looking and looking at every little abstract thing that, that might catch up in your brain. That might be a hint to help you with the clue. And then go back and read the book again, but slowly looking and looking at every little abstract thing that, that might catch up in your brain. That might be a hint to help you with the clues. Yes, Mr. Finn was a maverick, and this was his trail. The Maverick Trail in the Cimarron Canyon was a regular destination for trout fishing during the majority of Mr. Finn's life on this 